I'm really excited to share this video with you guys because I've been holding on to this stuff for ages because I've been waiting to film this video and now I finally can. So for this week I'm going to be doing a try on clothing haul. So Zaffle.com actually got in touch with me recently and asked me if I would like to choose a few clothes from their website. So I went over to their website and I had a little look and had a little browse. I say little, it actually took me ages because there's so much choice on there. But I did have a look and I found some really nice things that I really really like the look of. So they very kindly sent them over to me and once I got them I really really loved all of them and that for me is really rare because whenever I find a new online shop or store and buy clothes from it I always end up sending a bunch of it back because it doesn't fit right or it's not what I expected or the quality is not all there so when I got all this stuff and I love every single thing that they sent me I was just like beyond pleased so I'm more than happy to share this with you basically. So I'm going to go straight into it because I've got quite a lot of stuff and I'm also going to be trying everything on for you in this video so I'll be putting clips kind of over the top of how everything looks when it's on. Oh and if you do like the look of any of this stuff then just have a look in the description box because all of the links to every single item will be in there. So the first thing that I have is this little white top and I love this so much I think it's so pretty and like feminine and it's just got spaghetti straps at the top and then it's got kind of those like I call them gypsy sleeves I don't know if that's the correct term and then it's just kind of like a full length top it's not a crop top it looks like it might be but it's not it's full length and it's got really cute ruffles all around the top and I just love this so much I've actually already worn it which is why it's a little bit worse for wear there's a few foundation marks on the top of the neckline which is disgusting so that's the first thing and I got this in a large. I got most of the things in a large because whenever I'm buying something from an online kind of international store, like a Chinese store or whatever, their sizes usually run really, really small. But with Zaffle.com, I found that everything actually fit me a little bit big, which is a good thing because at least that means that they are true to size. So you don't have to kind of go for a size down like you normally would with a few other kind of like online stores. So if you are thinking of buying something from Zaffel, then just go for your actual size, not a size down. But everything that I bought is quite kind of like loose fitting. I don't wear a lot of tight fitting clothes, so that wasn't really an issue for me. It still fits me well. This next thing I have to admit, I've actually been wearing this like, I think every single day since I got it because I love it that much. And it's this denim jacket, but it's like really baggy and oversized. It's kind of got that like vintage Levi's feel to it. You'll be able to see when I try it on but it kind of goes out slightly at the pockets so it's kind of like a bat wing style if that makes sense but I love it so much it kind of has that like vintage grunge vibe going on about it. This is really wearable for like daytime or nighttime wherever you want to go this is your guy and I think this is honestly my new favourite jacket and it's already one of my wardrobe staples. So next I've got another jacket and this is just kind of like a red bomber jacket, it's got zips down the sleeve, it's got elasticated arms and it's elasticated around the bottom as well and I just thought this was a really nice colour and normally I don't really go for anything that's colour because my whole wardrobe is like black, white and grey but I kind of wanted to branch out a little bit and go for something <laughs> that's I say out of my comfort zone, but like it's only red. I don't know why I'm making such a big deal out of it. But I really love this kind of red. It's like a deep wine coloured red. And I find colour really difficult to kind of like incorporate into an outfit. But when it's a jacket, I feel like it's a lot easier. So that's one of the reasons why I got it. Then I've got another jacket, which is even more adventurous than that red one. And it's this one, which is black, kind of like silk effect. But then it's got this incredible embroidery on the front and also on the back as well and it's kind of like blossom kind of like a Japanese vibe I don't know I just really really love this and I think it's going to be amazing for spring this is longer than the red bomber jacket the red one was kind of a little bit cropped um, but this one has like a gold zip and it's got pockets and I just love this so much I'm really into like floral embroidery at the moment I think it looks so so lovely so that's that one <laughs> Next I have this and I can't even tell you how soft this thing is. It feels like cashmere, like it's genuinely so, so soft. And it's just kind of like a little sweatshirt with a hood and it's just really casual, really easy to throw on. It's basically loungewear, which is amazing because it is so, so soft. I love the color of it. It's like a 
browny purple colour. But I just think this will be really amazing for like lounging around the house, literally doing nothing because it's so comfortable. Then I just got this t-shirt, which is just a really casual piece that I needed because I don't have that many t-shirts really. And this is just white and grey striped. It's quite oversized, really casual really like it. It's got little slits at the side as well. Next I've got one of the best t-shirts I've ever seen in my life and I feel like it was actually made for me because this is just my life. I mean thumbs up if this t-shirt is you defined because it's me defined. It's literally just a plain black t-shirt that says I like dogs. I genuinely think this is my new favourite t-shirt. I'm just never going to take it off because why would I? The next thing I have is basically exactly the same as the I like dogs t-shirt but this one says 90s on it because obviously I'm a 90s baby. I was born in 1993, but I've seen these t-shirts around where they have like random years on them or like 80s, 70s, and I wanted a 90s one, repping the 90s babies. Also thumbs up if you're a 90s kid. Next up, I've got this bodysuit and I absolutely love this. It's just like a white kind of sheer material and it's got like a sewn in collar on it so you don't even have to wear a choker because this has got your back already but as I said before I love like floral embroidery this season and this has just got like red roses and stuff this is actually really similar to the bodysuit I wore on my 24th birthday but this is obviously white and short sleeved but I think this like tucked into a skirt or some nice trousers with a jacket on top will just look really really cute and I'm definitely gonna be wearing it soon for a night out so and then, as if I haven't already got enough floral embroidery things in my life, <laughs> I've got this as well. And this also has like a sewn in collar, but this is a play suit. And then it's got the embroidery on each boob and it's got little shorts at the bottom. I have tried this on and I'm gutted because it's too short for me. Most play suits, to be honest, are too short for me because I'm so tall, but everything else about it, I absolutely love. Like it fits so nicely everywhere else and it's really flattering, but unfortunately it's just way too short. Like I could never wear it out. But because the bottom bit is like double layered, I might see if I can get it altered so that they can put like another layer in underneath because I do really, really love it. And it's literally the only problem with it. It's just too nice to not wear. So I really hope that I can sort that out. I also got this little bralette, which is just to wear underneath like oversized t-shirts and stuff. It's just got like a little lace flower on the front. I really like the fact that this fastens in the front so you can put it on like um, a backpack almost. And then you can just fasten it in the front with this little clasp. Um, I think that's just so much easier than <laughs> trying to fiddle around with like really thin straps at the back and stuff. And then at the back, you have this really cool like single racer back strap, which I think is really nice and different. I think I'm gonna have a really hard time showing this. But the next thing I got is just one of those like tie up chokers that you wear around your neck, obviously. And it's got like little gold bits on the end, but it just looks like a piece of string at the moment, but I promise you it's a choker. <laughs> and then I randomly got this owl bag and I didn't actually choose this. They just randomly sent it to me like extra, which was nice of them. Although I don't know if I'll ever use it because I don't think it's really my style. It seems a bit kind of like young for me. So I might give this to my niece or I don't know, someone who wants it, who's a little bit younger, because I think it'd be good for them. Um, but it's still cute, nevertheless. So that's it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. I absolutely love every single thing that Zaffle sent me. So thank you so much, Zaffle. I love everything. Let me know in the comments which was your favourite item that I tried on, and I'll try to reply to as many of you as I possibly can. If you haven't already and you would like to, make sure to subscribe to my channel so that you're aware of whenever I post a new video in the future. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.